Colorado, as you know, Molly, this year is good to great. They've been good. They're hoping that this is a breakthrough season. Here's Ty Chandler. The ball came out at the end of the run. And Wake Forest believes it has it. And the Demon Deacons do. Travion Red recovered the fumble on the first play of the game. 89.7% of his kicks in his career. Second all time. And he improves on that percentage by making a 27 yarder. Loves the weight room. They have to kick him out of the weight room. Here he comes on a design run. He lowers his shoulder and scores. He just ran over Nick Anderson on his way to the end zone for the seventh time this year. The defense in, and here's the power at the end. He's not a make you miss guy. Lined up across from one of the tight ends, Blake Whitehart. Now third and 15. More time for Hartman. Down the middle is a man wide open. First down to the 45. Jaquari Roberson, their leading receiver. Been one of the hottest receivers in the country. Three straight 100 yard games coming in. Hartman's looking at him. Hartman's looking at the end zone and gets there. And Sam Hartman saw grass to the end zone. Good decision by Hartman, matching the running ability of Sam Howe. As we take a look at the replay for the progressive pylon. But the pressure so far early in this game has been a little bit different. Carolina rushed only three. Hartman throws an interception. Cameron Kelly takes it back for the Tar Heels. Downs has 70 catches this year. Quarterback draw again. Howell again into the end zone. <laughs> so strong. You're going to see the first missed tackle in the backfield right there. And now just arm tackles. People trying to fly at him. Which is running a play on first and ten. Sam Hartman. Quarter of the end zone. Well, Catch is well. made. Corey Roberson for a touchdown. Darrow moving his quarterback out of the pocket. North Carolina been able to get pressure in the pocket. Does he maintain control? Feeder in. Catch was made. Control on the way to the ground from the progressive pylon cam. This is a great catch by Roberson. And a good timing, good execution. Ty Chandler. Touchdown, North Carolina. The fifth lead change of this game, and there's still 9.41 to go until halftime. His 10th rushing touchdown of the year. He got you down here. Why not let him pay it off? He has emerged as a Heisman Trophy candidate at Michigan State. Pressure off the corner. Hartman to the end zone. A one-handed catch by A.T. Perry. Couldn't get free from Cameron Kelly. So he said, all I need is one arm. And it's a 32-yard touchdown. Let's to the short side of the field. He knew he had a safety trying to cover his big receiver and makes a perfect throw. And you can see Perry, the strength. Here's the blitz from the corner. Hartman sees it right away and gives his receiver a chance. And going with the quick count for the sneak and the first down. Hartman throwing deep. Barnes open and has a touchdown. He got behind three Tar Heel defenders. And the backside safety was watching the eyes of the quarterback and a beautiful throw for this Wake Forest defense in the red zone. Jason Atkins kicks a 31-yard field goal as time expires. To the play fake. Howell throwing deep single coverage. And it is caught. What a catch by Justin Olsen. So we'll give up a lot of yards. But we think red zone defense is very important. They are good at it. They force the field goal by Atkins. Second and ten. They're in field goal range. Wake Forest leading by four. They run a quarterback draw. Effectively so. Touchdown, Sam Hartman. 
This is perfect. Now watch. This linebacker is going to blitz here. The back's going in motion. He's going there. They pull the tackle around to block here. Perfect execution and timing. They clear out the middle. The tackle, Zach Tom, gets the block on the other side. Linebacker and Hartman goes untouched into the end zone. Everything that we've talked about all day long is indicative of a well-coached team. They don't turn it over. They don't commit penalties. They have a man wide open. They have beautiful play design. Perry stumbled a bit. Will they catch him? He dives for the pylon and scores. There's a flag back near the line of scrimmage along the near sideline. Watch this safety as this fake takes so long, he just can't help himself but to come up. And as soon as he takes two steps up, A.T. Perry runs right by him. And that's an easy throw and catch for Wake Forest. They just continue to do the same thing. And when you get too aggressive or get out of position, Sam Hartman makes you pay as we see it from the progressive pot. 10,429 yards of total offense for Howell, six more than Williams. Already the all-time passing yardage leader, trying to throw a touchdown pass, and he does. Antoine Green, the catch. One-on-one -on -one out here. And this is against Zion Keith, number 28. Remember, Gavin Holmes, one of the starting corners, out for the rest of the game. Be a 42-yard try. It is good. We overtook him by 21 points last year, but this is a better Wake Forest team this year that we're dealing with. Four down territory, you would think. That's a move. Point as Chandler's round. in the end zone. Tough run by Ty Chandler. 13 yards, and it is a one-score game with a long way to go in Chapel Hill. Nice day for Chandler, averaging 7.6 per carry. He's been in the end zone twice. Wake is 6 out of 13 on third down. Hartman stepped up in the pocket, throws an interception. Picked off by Kelly again, and he brings it back to the 21-yard line. Chandler with blockers. Ty Chandler, another touchdown. Three touchdown runs, a career high for Ty Chandler. They pull the center, they pull the tackle. Now watch the tackle. You want to see some athleticism? Watch 74, Jordan Tucker. He gets all the way to the safety ahead of the back to get a block. Under 10 minutes to go. Wake Forest trying to continue the best start in school history. Here's Justice Ellison down the sideline and shoved out of bounds. Inside the 40, they'll mark it at the 36. Wells thrown for 216, rushed for 102. Chandler has already scored three times. Ty Chandler inside the 15. 25-yard attempt by Grayson Atkins. Excellent field goal kicker. And right down the middle. That was a big moment. Penalty takes him back to the 50. Chandler breaking tackles. What a game for Ty Chandler. Into the end zone for the fourth time. And they got to bring linebackers. Watch the right guard and the right tackle just collapse those two blitzers inside and a big hole for Ty Chandler and then broken tackles of his own. And this guy has had a career day running with strength, running with vision, running with passion. And North Carolina extends their lead. You got to score as quick as possible. Hartman faked to Dallison. Hartman throws. And it's caught for a touchdown by Roberson. Looked like he might have gotten away with a little shove to get free as the ball was on the way. 14 yards. Roberson is the guy I think you need to work. He's got inside coverage by the safety, Conley. And the other safety, Morrison, not able to get over the top to help in time. That's a beautiful throw. But they're still in great shape in the ACC. Bear in mind, this was not a conference game even though they're conference opponents. 
So they are still in control. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.